Hello everyone, in this video, we're going to have an update about the astronauts stuck in space. NASA says Boeing Starliner astronauts may have to come home on different spacecraft. Two astronauts who went up into the International Space Station on Boeing Starliner may have to come home on a different spacecraft, NASA officials said during the press conference Wednesday. Bar Butch Wilmore and Sun Ita Suni Williams, who performed the first crewed test flight of the Starliner, have been in space for more than 60 days. When they launched on June 5, they were only supposed to be on the ISS for about a week. Boeing and NASA officials have been resistant to exploring the option to bringing the crew home on another method, but Kenneth Browser Sox, NASA's associate administrator for space operations, said the team is considering it. Quote, we don't just have to bring a crew back on Starliner, for example. We can bring them back on another vehicle, he said. In the case that we have with the Starliner crew, flight tests the option to either bring the crew home on Starliner or to bring the crew home on another vessel. We can take either path. Quote, Browser Sox said, There is currently more consensus needed among the team but they are also getting more serious about evaluating our other options steve stitch program manager for nasa's commercial crew program said nasa is considering sending space axes dragon crew 9 set to launch to the iss in september with only two of the four astronauts assigned to it the spacecraft would carry an extra spacesuits for Wilmore and Williams. However, the two would remain on the ISS until February 2025, when Crew 9 is set to return to Earth. Stitch said, The proposed plan has not formally been approved yet. Quote, Our prime option is to return Butch and Sunni on the Starliner. However, we have done requisite planning. To make sure we have other options open, Stitch said. Stitch added that the Starliner does not currently have the ability to autonomously undock from the ISS. To do that, the Starliner software would need to be updated and the Boeing flight control team would need to undergo additional training. This took a turn, it's a very tedious situation, and I think that it's very horrid what happened in this situation, but hopefully they bring them back home. It's crazy that they have to bring another spacecraft up there to get them back, and it'll be a little while, a couple of more months before they get them down. But hopefully they come back safely, thoughts and prayers for them, and we'll see how this goes. Alright, thank you all for watching this update. Feel free to comment below your thoughts.